I've been running year round since the summer of 2017. When I tell people that I run, a lot of them ask, why do you like running so much? As if they expect a question of such depth to elicit a response short enough to be condensed into a socially acceptable amount of time. The truth is, I don't run for the exercise, I don't run for the sport, nor for the competition. I love my running friends, but they're not the reason. I run to reach my potential. I only have a limited number of years left to reach my physical potential, and the sooner I get started, the higher I can go. As Olympian Nick Simmons says, there's no better feeling than working your ass off toward a goal and doing something new and incredible your body's never been able to do before. This quote sums up why I run. To anyone out there just starting to run or thinking about starting to run, just know it's gonna suck. But once you get the feeling of success, a small accomplishment, you'll be hooked. Whether for you that means being able to run two miles without stopping for the first time or breaking six minutes in the mile, you'll eventually find a fuel that keeps you going. For me, that accomplishment came during freshman year of cross country. Let me rewind. I was somehow convinced to sign up for a local 5K the week after eighth grade graduation. My time, 31.02, a 10.01 pace. 364 days and about 600 miles later, I ran the same 5K in 25.10 or an 8.07 pace. That 5K was my running milestone. I'm running it again in 29 days. Since then, I've been able to get my mile down below 7 minutes and my 5K pace under 8 minutes per mile, which is a huge milestone for me. I'm on track to run over 1,000 miles in 2019. Running has also taught me the lesson of delayed gratification. You won't feel the benefits of your run that day, or even that week for that matter. You'll feel all your training compounding once you step on the start line on race day. It'll all be worth it. So go out, run, find your milestone, and make your mark.